Hello everyone, this is Mark with MrHurricaneTracker.webs.com. Today is December 17, 2011. Bringing you some breaking news information out of Yellowstone National Park. And this is an update for today. As you see, there's some earthquake activity surrounding the Yellowstone National Park area. And I'd like to talk about that and bring an article that I posted on MrHurricaneTracker.webs.com. This article was brought to you by the Extinction Protocol. You can go ahead and click on that link there and definitely take you to their site to give you more information on what's happening across the globe. But specifically right now, I want to talk about this article. I'd like to read you the article, so definitely pay attention to what's going on in Yellowstone. Uh, right now, this article, I wanted to uh, go ahead and bring this to your attention. This article says, NASA Landsat satellites have been tracking Yellowstone's underground geothermal activity, a deep heat that is stored 4,000 miles into the Earth's core. But there are areas where these energy levels are becoming erratic. Old Faithful could be in trouble. The Landsat program is jointly managed by NASA and the U.S. Geological Survey, beginning its services of remote sensing in 1972. It became part of Yellowstone's National Park new monitoring plan in 2005. In addition to remote sensing, Landsat also uses airborne reconnaissance in order to observe geothermal changes across all of Yellowstone in a systematic and scientific manner. NASA, up until recently, has Nice until recently, the heat is coming from Yellowstone underground magma chamber has always been the fuel for over 10,000 of the volcano's features. Old Faithful, Hot Springs Geysers, Mud Spots and Terraces, and Mud Pots. But NASA is reporting that the Landsat imagery has picked up some unexpected developments outside the park's borders, also picked up by energy companies beyond the park's borders as well. If that geo, it says here, if that geothermal development outside of the park begins, we need to know whether that is go, that's going to cause Old Faithful to suddenly stop spewing, says Rick Lawrence of Montana State University. The Landsat satellite allows scientists to recognize big changes occurring in the geothermal area like Yellowstone. However, nobody knows what is happening or were due to the satellite large pixel size and imagery, but clues are beginning to uh, are being found regarding the interconnection of the underground geothermal events. Now, guys, these posts are posts from places like the Extinction Protocol. You know, are definitely something you want to watch for. But the main post that you want to look for is the YBO update. This is a Yellowstone Volcano Observatory update. And this link here, I'll post a link in the description of the video for this link. If you look at this very carefully, it says that the current uh, current aviation color code is green. Current volcano alert is normal. And any updates that come from this site will be posted right here. So if anything changes, such as the code of the alert level, will change right here live. So looking at that actual article, saying that there could be activity but nothing's changed here on the YBO update so keep watch on the YBO update and we'll continue to get you updated as best as we can according to information this updates live this is a, a monthly report though of what's happening in the area so you can check that out and uh, as far as the information says here during the month of November 2011 for 51 earthquakes were located in the Yellowstone National Park region the last was a magnitude 3.0 event on November 28 at 11.02 a.m. MST, located about seven miles west southwest of Old Faithful. No swarms were recorded in November. So, we definitely want to keep an eye on it with this website as well. We'll uh, definitely track what's happening in the area, and I'll continue to keep you posted if I do get any more updates on this breaking news story. So, thank you for watching, guys. Please rate, subscribe, and comment, and have a wonderful day.